Okay, so as you guys can see, I upgraded from using this bed and this dresser as a desk to get an actual dresser and an actual chair. Now, let's talk about them. And I'm gonna call this series the Ultimate Minimal Max Setup. Okay, so I got this desk off Wayfair and this chair. And let's just say, I know you guys are probably thinking, why Wayfair? Well, they had this clearance sale going on and I'm like, I just want a desk and chair now. I was just tired of using that bed as a dresser. That bed as a dresser, listen to me. Ugh. I was just using that dresser and bed as a desk and chair. Now, anyways, it worked, but it was not ideal and terrible for my back. Okay, before I get into too much detail about everything, this series is going to be just slowly upgrading, adding things to the setup to make it better. And it's just going to be, at the end of the day, the Ultimate Max setup. This desk is called the Curry Desk. There's a couple of things that I didn't like about it. Now a desk is a desk at the end. Either way, I'm happy because I'm not using my bed and dresser as a desk setup anymore. Now, I really like the finish to this. Now, it's not real wood. It just looks like some paper they threw on some tabletop. The reason I think that is because of there's little screwables at the sides of the desk to attach the tabletop onto and some just started peeling. Now I wasn't so happy but it's all right. I'm just saying bro I got a desk. I'm just ecstatic to build this and actually start using this. I wish it did come up with a cap to put over the screw holes. The desk is only 47 inches so not terribly big but also not too small. So. It's kind of like the right spot almost. I just wish I had another foot or two. That way I wasn't worried about being cramped when I add the external monitor. So stay tuned in for that. Honestly, this is a nice sturdy and good desk to use for a desk setup, especially for the price. I only got it for like $82. Now, time for the chair. This chair is called the Comfy Task Chair. And let's just say it is comfy. Now it does come with adjustable arms, has adjustable height, has lumbar support, neck support, and you can recline in it. I just don't really recline much. This chair has honestly helped me to stand up more straight as I walk and as I just live my life. The lumbar support is honestly one of my favorite features of this besides adjustable arms and the reclining. Okay, every feature of this I really like because I never had neck rest, never had adjustable arms. I've always seemed to have tilt in my chairs, so that wasn't like a huge thing to me. I'm like, I'm gonna make sure it has it, obviously. But having all this support and having an ergonomic chair just changes your life, honestly. So, if you're thinking about getting a chair, I would check this one out. It was around like 145 bucks when I got it, but again, these were on clearance, so they might be gone by the time I have this video upload. But if I find them, I'll leave links down below for everything. I got this nice phone stand to put beside my MacBook. That way I just can check my notifications as I get them or just use my phone as I need it. That way I don't have to keep picking it up. I can just look over or I can just put my hand around and start typing and doing what I need to do. Very nice to have. Got a little eye candy right here. If you got a MacBook and you need a screen cleaner because all of them don't work, check out this video.